Hello, beautiful people. So this is the first episode of my small business diaries. I am. I am a little nervous to record this because to even start this series, not just record it, but to start this series for a couple of reasons. The first one being the biggest that I am going to take people on this journey as I start this small business and I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Not a clue. Some things I know and I'm like really confident and in other areas I I don't know. I just I'm just going to do and see what happens and I feel like if this is how I feel there have to be other people that feel this way. And I also the second reason that I'm doing this is because I also think that there are people that want to start a small business or they want to kind of take a leap of faith and they just want some type of inspiration. And so I'm hoping that this is an inspiration and I'm hoping that as I document my journey, like document it all, um, that people are encouraged and uplifted. And so I, there is not an exact schedule to how this is going to be put out or how often it's going to be put out as I get things going and done that's what I'm gonna do and so oh the third reason the third reason I'm making this is because I really need accountability um I feel like I have all these ideas and I map them out and I get so far and I know that that's because I'm a really good starter I'm really good at seeing the vision of something and laying out what needs to be done, but more of the small minute things that have to be done on a daily basis, which is a lot when you are starting a small business or a small business owner, it's a lot. That is why they hire and they're like, we need good people because it's difficult, it's very challenging and there are a lot of small things that take up a lot of time, you know? And so it's really important to be able to delegate and all that. Anyway, with that being said, um, I really want accountability because I notice that I go really hard and then I burn out. I go really hard and then I burn out. And I really, for me, I want to see more consistency. And so I think that if I am consistently making these videos and later on, as that consistency is solidified, I can have a schedule. But for now, my big thing is just creating the videos, putting it out there, and hopefully you guys will like it. We'll see. Okay, so in this episode, FYI, if you hear a noise in the background, it's because I'm doing my laundry. Like, this series is gonna be so real, it's ridiculous. And mostly because I've been doing YouTube for like two and a half years, and there's a lot that goes into filming, recording, editing, all of that stuff, and I just, I'm just gonna do. My big focus is taking action and just doing. So when the time is right, I'm gonna record videos and it may not necessarily be like perfect, AKA the laundry is being done right now. And that's okay with me because I just, this is life, you know, it's real, it's authentic. That's my goal anyway. Okay, so this week, oh my gosh, I say this week, which is better than last week because that was a hot mess. But this week, this is week 25 in the year. And I am going to focus on two big things. I'm gonna put my attention and focus on two big things, actually three. The first one is finding a job here in Florida. Uh, yes, I have a small business, it's registered, but I am like in the trenches building this thing. And I have a vision, but it is at the very beginning stages. And so I need an income and that means I'm gonna have a job. So that's, that's the first thing. The second thing is completing my list of business to do's and some of the things that are on there are like launching my smart cart website completing my ebooks i have an entire series of books that i'm gonna do filming videos for youtube um such as this one and others um writing out my goals and publishing them online one of the things that i personally want to do is have my personal website where there's a lot of great content in relation to wealth creation productivity, organization, relationships, um, like there's a lot on there. Finance, goals, all that stuff is on there. I want to be very transparent so people can see 
I said this time and time again, and I really want to leave a trail for other people so that they can see and they can be inspired. Hopefully they're inspired. I mean, that's, that's what I pray. Anyway, so I want to upload some content to my website and put that there. Um, and then I want to map out a list of products that I really want to bring to the market. I really want things that are going to help people, especially this next generation. So I'm in my 30s and I feel like those that are 17, 18, 19 are walking into a world that is very different than what myself and even previous generations have experienced. It's wild. Um, I have my own two cents as the reason why I'll fill you in on some other videos as well as possibly later in this one, but there are definitely reasons why. And so I want to make sure that I map out good quality products. One of the things that I have said is that I really want to empower, especially young women, but I really want to empower young people. And I find that doing that, the best way to do that is through tools and resources. And so giving them the tools and resources to learn and to make decisions and to be intentional with their life. And so I have to sit down and create products that are around that outside of my eBooks. Finally, on this list, I need to, should have had this, don't have this. I need to get my domain name and set up like all of my social stuff, which is so crazy. Now my refrigerator is super loud. It is what it is. Anyway, um, so I need to do those two things. My goal is to get all of that done um, by Friday. Oh, and I have to open business bank accounts here in Florida. So there's a lot that's going into this and it's fine, but this is kind of the not so pretty side of running a business. It's really like the administrative, minute, small tasks, all things that have to get done, they have to get done in order for it to be successful. And I, I need to get it done because I just can't be in this same place anymore. I just know that these things that are inside of me have to get out and yeah, anyway, we're gonna, that's gonna be my focus in addition to the other two things. So, oh, the third thing. Um, oh my gosh, I almost forgot the third thing. So I have get a job, uh, I have complete my business goals. And then the third thing is going to uh, my class every week. So I have a health and fitness class that I go to that I really enjoy. Um, it's awesome. It's a self-defense class and I, it's dreamy. And so I, my third goal is to make sure that I go to that at least three times this week if not four. However, um, let me tell you that class is pretty intense. And so like physically, sometimes I just hurt and I'm like, I need a day of rest. So we'll see how this goes. 